The Lord, you are warmly welcome to our enough is enough program today. Right there, where you are, I want you to close your eyes as you pray. Everlasting King of Glory, Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, the Alpha, the Omega, beginning and the end, the one that knows the end from the beginning. Father, we thank you. We bless your name for all that you have been doing in our enough is enough program. Thank you for the enemies jeer that you have put into reverse. Thank you for disgracing the strong man. Thank you, Father, for everything you have done. We give you praise. Accept our thanks in the name of Jesus. Today, glorify yourself. Let everything which I do bring glory to your name. Shape to the devil. Blessing to us in Jesus' name. Right there where you are, sing this song loud and clear with me. Sing it from the bottom of your heart. Glorify yourself, Lord. Glorify yourself, Lord. Glorify yourself, Lord. In our midst, Oluwa, glorify yourself, Lord. Glorify yourself, Lord. Glorify yourself, Lord. In our midst, do something new in our midst, something new in this place, do something new in our midst. Today, oh, do I do something new in our midst, something new in this place, do something new in our midst. Today, God, we make our way where there seems to be no way. He walks the way we cannot see. He will make our way for us. He will be our guide. Oh, me closest to his side. With love and strength for each new day. He will make a way. He will make a way. Say you are the pillar that holds my life. Ah, you are the pillar. You are the pillar that holds my life. Master Jesus, you are the pillar that holds my life. Master Jesus, you are the pillar that was my life. Thank you, Father. Right there where you are, I want you to shout this prayer for yourself loud and clear. Pray it from your heart. Say this loud and clear. Say, agents of darkness, pronouncing evil upon my life, wherever you are, Whoever you are, fall down and die. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and pray. Say, agent of darkness, pronounce the evil upon my life. Wherever you are, whoever you are, fall down and die. Fall down and die. That brother, that sister, don't negotiate. Command them to die. In Jesus, never pray. Say, anything in my life, retaining evil voices to trouble my life. Beloved, please pray this one violently. Say anything in my life, retaining evil voices to trouble my life. My father, remove them by fire. Open your mouth and pray. Let them be removed. Whatever is retaining evil voices to trouble your life. Every voice of divination, enchantment, uh -huh. voice of curses, right there where you are. Uh -huh. Let them be removed. Let them be removed. In Jesus, now we pray. Father, I thank you once again. In Jesus' name. Open your Bible wherever you are connected to us to the book of Psalm 55, verse 1 to 3. I'm looking at, in our Enough is Enough program today, 
silencing the voice of darkness. Silencing the voice of darkness. Psalm 55. We are going to read together from verse 1 to 3. Psalm 55. It says, Give ear to my prayer, O God, and hide not thyself from my supplication. Say, Attend to me and hear me. I mourn in my complaint and make a noise. Say, Because of the voice of the enemy. Say, Because of the oppression of the wicked. For they cast iniquity upon me, and in wrath they hated me. In wrath they hate me. Beloved, keep that scripture at the back of your mind. Quickly, I go into the book of Jeremiah, chapter 15. I read from verse 20. It says, And I will make thee unto these people a fence, brazen war, and they shall fight against thee, but they shall not prevail. Say against thee. Say, for I am with thee to save thee and to deliver thee, saith the Lord. In verse 21, say, and I will deliver thee out of the hands of the wicked. And I will redeem thee out of the hands of the terrible. Silencing the voice of darkness. Beloved, there are multiple voices bombarding us as human beings day and night. Voices, they are powerful entities that can affect man or woman positively or negatively. There are positive voices and there are negatives. There are good and bad voices. Beloved, there are internal and external voices. I said there are, there are good, that is, godly voices. Let me quickly analyze that. Godly voices, they are, number one, voice of God. It's a godly one. God called Samuel. In 1 Samuel chapter 3, verse 4, and the Lord said, he called Samuel, and he answered, he said, here I am. That is the voice of God. You see it in 1 Samuel chapter 3, verse 4. That's the voice of God. It's a godly one. Number two, the voice of the angels. An angel appeared unto Zechariah. And he spoke to him. In Luke chapter 1, when you read from verse 12 to 13. And when Zechariah saw him, he was troubled. And fear fell upon him. In verse 13. Say, but the angel said unto him, Fear not, Zechariah, for thy prayer is heard, and thy wife Elizabeth shall bear thee a son, and thou shalt call him John. Thou shalt call his name John. So that's the voice of an angel. The same thing happened in Luke chapter 1, verse 28. And the angel came unto Mary and said to her, Hail! Thou art highly favored. The Lord is with thee. Say, blessed are thou amongst women. The voice of angel. So that voice brought good news and blessings to the life of these people. I pray the voice of God that will bless you this month shall rest upon your life. In the name of Jesus. Number three, the voice of godly men and women of God. Though the voice of Holy Spirit, or the voice of godly men and women will come to you through the voice of the Holy Spirit. It has come to do what? To bless you. Number four, the voice of the Holy Spirit inside the believers. All these are godly voices. They are godly voices when they come to you. But there is negative voice. Number one, the voice of divination. That is, uh, forces dividing evil against people. They too, they have their voice. There is a voice of diviners, evil people. Number three, the voice of astrologers and horoscopes. Number four, 
the voice of witchcraft forces. Once those voices comes out, it comes with evil agenda. Number five, the voice of familiar spirits. Six, there is what we call occultic voices. Seven, there is a voice from the coven of darkness. Eight, the voices of evil clinical prophecies. If you accept it, it will stay. Number nine, the voice from the grief. Once the voice comes and the fellow answers to it, it is a deadly one. Number ten, voices from evil dreams. Evil dreams. Some in their dream, they find people speaking negative words to them in the dream. And sometimes it manifests in the physical. Beloved, there is voices of you can never enemy. That is, the voice aside against you to stop your progress. And I pray every voice of darkness assigned to stop your progress shall backfire. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Number two, there is the voice of darkness which is what you want to destroy today. There are these are negative voices. We are here, beloved, to silence those voices. They must proceed no further. We are here to say enough is enough. Beloved, few statements about voices. Number one, voice has its own expression. Two, voice has its own meaning. Three, voices has its own power. That is backing it up. There are demons attached to negative voices to ensure that they carry out the evil plan upon the life of men and women. I want you to close your eyes now. Say, I disobey the voice of darkness by the power in the blood of Jesus. Open your mouth and say, I disobey the voice of darkness by the power in the blood of Jesus. I disobey the voice of darkness by the power in the blood of Jesus. Beloved, the voice you hear can affect your life, either positively or negatively, depending on the voice of you hear. Close your eyes again. Say, voice of darkness that is affecting my life. You are a liar. Die in the name of Jesus. Kill the voice. Every voice of darkness affecting my life. Die by fire. Die by fire. Die. 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 Aha. That's right. Kill the voice. That brother. That sister. Brother. Yes. Aha. Uh -huh. In Jesus. Now we pray. Beloved, another fact I want you to know is that right voices that you listen to will move your life to uncommon breakthrough. Unfortunately, wrong voices will lead to unpardonable and grievous mistakes and that will not be a portion. Beloved, many, many years ago in Qatar here, a brother lived very close to my house. That period I just came to Qatar newly and he lived very, very close to the house where I was living at that time. Beloved, one night he called me. Say, Pastor, Pastor, please, 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 come, 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 come. Ah, come by this time of the day at the middle of the night. It's okay. The Lord said, Go. And I left my apartment and went to his own. By the time I got inside his apartment, I noticed something strange. All the chairs, the settee, they were upside down. Uh uh. What happened? He said, Pastor, wait. He took me to the toilet. By the time I got to the toilet, I saw the toilet bowl, you know, broken. Uh -uh. And water all over the place on the floor. So, now, and I said, okay, let's go back to the sitting room. I now sat him down. Tell me exactly what happened. He said, Pastor, he had a voice. And the voice said, go and knock your head on the wall. It is so. He knock his head. I could see the the face. He knock his head on the wall. Then the voice now asked him again to go to the toilet. He went to the toilet. 
and hit his head on the toilet bowl. That was how the toilet bowl was broken. Ah, then I asked a question. I said, is that voice still operating now? He said, no. <laughs> Maybe immediately I enter, the voice stops. From that day, I started to conduct personal deliverance for him. I thank God because what the plan of God for the enemy was to destroy him. But thank God for deliverance. That is what a very good example of what I call the voice of darkness. The voice of darkness. The, that voice was from the pit of hell to destroy him. That voice had three agendas. To steal, to kill, and to destroy. But thank God for deliverance. I pray for somebody connected to this program. Every voice of darkness assigned to destroy your life shall die by fire. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. What can we do? Number one, to silence the voice of darkness, repent from every known sin. Two, surrender your life to Jesus that has the capacity to silence those voices. Three, soak yourself in the blood of Jesus. Four, arrest those negative voices. Arrest them with the ability of God inside of you. With the power of God invested in your life. Arrest those voices. Five, be careful about the voice of agents of darkness that are all over the place in social media. The purpose of those strange voices is to silence the new men and women of God serving God faithfully, used by God to deliver people from the hands of Satan. Number six, barricade your life from future attacks from evil voices with the agenda to steal, to kill, and to destroy. Barricade your life from them. Don't allow them to operate again upon your life. Right there where you are. I'm not just surrendering your life to Jesus. You say, Pastor, I want to surrender my life to Jesus. Me too, I want to pray to destroy satanic voices. Voice of darkness. Lay your hand on your chest and say this after me. Say, Father, I come before you today. I know that I'm a sinner. Lord Jesus, come into my life. Come and take control of my life. From today, I renounce Satan and his agents. I enter into the kingdom of light. Write my name in the book of life and put the devil to shame. Thank you, Father. Jesus, name we pray. Say that your prayer with me. Continue to follow us in all our programs. God bless you in Jesus' mighty name. Right there where you are, the first prayer I want you to pray. Pray with merciless violence. Sing this song loud and clear. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. Holy Ghost arise. Oh, enough is enough. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. Holy Ghost arise. Oh, enough is enough. Holy Ghost, deliver me by fire. Holy Ghost, deliver me by fire. Holy Ghost, deliver me by deliver me by fire by me by fire by fire. Amen. Say evil voice assigned to demote my destiny. Shut up and die in the name of Jesus. Evil voice assigned to demote my destiny. Shut up and die. Shut up and die. Command those voices to shut up. Shut up, shut up and die. Shut up and die. In Jesus, now we pray. Please, I want you to gather more aggression as we pray. Because a voice came to the man of God, uh, John the Baptist, the voice of darkness, voice of the wicked, it came against him. And that voice had an agenda. The agenda of that voice was to cut off his head. And they eventually succeeded. Beloved, but a man of God, Elijah, when the voice of darkness came against him, he says, if I be a child of God, if I be a man of God, let fire come down and consume you and your 50. The voice was a voice of demotion. They want to reduce the man to zero and eventually kill him. But it did not allow the voice to survive. It silenced their voice. Are you ready? Say evil voice, evil voice. assigned to demote my destiny. Shut up and die in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and kill. Kill that evil voice. Ma pota karibo sotodia. 
Ripo sotoni alikaba. Mapota kanda ya baba. That's right. That's right. That's right. Command the voice to die. Command it to die. In Jesus. Now we pray. Amen. Say wrong voice. From the enemy. Assigned to lead me to disaster. Because there are voices with the agenda. The agenda is to lead people to disaster. To sorrow, tragedy, calamity. Are you ready? We are in the ember month. The month is about, I mean, we are in October now. November, December, ember month. The enemy is in a rage now. So I want you to pray from your heart. Four people went and committed suicide. They had a strange voice that made them to commit suicide. The, the, those voices gave them the reason why they should commit suicide. One said because uh, somebody, you know, he, she was jilted by somebody. Is that a good reason to commit suicide? Those voices that gave them the reason that they should commit suicide is what you want to deal with. Are you ready? Say wrong voices from the enemy are sent to lead me to disaster. You are a liar. Die by fire. Command them to die. Every wrong voice are sent to lead me to disaster. Go, 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 go. Aha. That brother, enough is enough. Enough is enough. They must die. They must die. Those voices must die. My porter, Capone, and Capa, Ripo Sotoni, and Capa, Diaba. That's right, that's right. Be released, be released by the power in the blood. Be released from every strength voice. Be released from every strength voice by the power in the blood of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. In Jesus, now we pray. I pray for that sister and that brother connected to this program. Every voice of divination, voice of enchantment, vo aha. Voice of occulting voices, familiar spirit voices, uh -huh, assigned to wreck your life. Right there where you are, I silence them. I silence them. I silence them. In the name of Jesus, you that fellow connected to this program, that they normally chant your name every night. Every night they chant your name. I decree by the decree of heaven, if they chant your name again, they shall fall down and die. In the name of Jesus, right there where you are, shout this one. Say, any strange voice assigned to stop my progress. Beloved, please don't joke with this one. Somebody was working in a very, I mean, good bank, was working in a bank, and they were about to promote the fellow. All of a sudden, a now tender resignation. The boss calling and said, come here. Why did you tell that? We are about to promote it. He said, no, no, no. I'm leaving this bank. I'm leaving this bank. I'm leaving. Beloved, by the time he left the bank, after three months, they saw him in the village, in a farm, you know, tilling farm. And somebody now asked him, say, but you are doing a good job in Lagos. What happened to you? He said, he did not know the reason why he resigned. He did not know. He had a voice. The voice said, go and resign your appointment. That is evil voice. Are you ready? Say, any strange voice, voice. assigned to stop my program. Bad fire. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and pray. Command the voice of bad fire. That's right. That's right. That's right. That voice was bad fire. Bad fire. Bad fire. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus. Now we pray. Beloved, there are multiple voices now. That people, in fact, there are voices that confuse people. They don't know what to do again. He's hearing this one. Hearing that. Hearing, uh, they, all those voices bombarded somebody. It's a terrible thing indeed. And that's what normally causes frustration and depression. When somebody is hearing too many voices, he, he did not know what they want to answer. Are you ready? Say multiple voices. Shout it louder than that. Bombardy my lord. Day and night. Scatter by fire. Scatter those voices. That's right. Command them to scatter. They must scatter. They must scatter. Every voice of darkness. Aha. Uh -huh. Voice from the waters. Command them to scatter. 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 
Thank you, Father. In Jesus, may we pray. Please gather your aggression. If you can't finish this prayer today, we, we postpone it till next week. Are you ready? But I want you to pray conclusive prayers. Pray with merciless violence. Say multiple voices. Bombarding my life. Aha. Scatter by fire. Open your mouth and scatter them. Your brother, scatter them. Many voices. Occultive voices. Let them be scattered. Let them be scattered. Let them be scattered. My pastor, Capodia. That's right. Be released. Be released by the power. In the blood. Be released. Be released. Be released. From those strange voices. By the power. In Jesus. Now we pray. Shout this one again loud and clear. Say, Satanic voices. Surrounding my life. I bury you now. Beloved, enough is enough. Bury them. Are you ready? Satanic voices. Surrounding my life. I bury you now. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and pray. Enough is enough. Let them be buried. Let them be buried. Let those voices be buried. Let them be buried. In the name of Jesus. I bury you now. I bury you now. Every voice of darkness. Voice of familiar spirit. Occulting voices. Familiar spirit voices. Let them be buried. Let them be buried. Let them be buried. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus. Now we pray. Beloved, please shout this one loud and clear. Say, voice of Antichrist. An agent of darkness. From the internet. Assigned to influence my life. Be silent forever. In the name of Jesus. Silence them. Silence them forever. My potter Capodia. Risopodia de Catandayama. That's right. That's right. That's right. Let them be silent. Let them be silent. There must be silence. Thank you, Father. In Jesus. Now we pray. Now shout this one loud and clear. There's what you call voice of witchcraft. In that their kovu, their witchcraft kovu, they can issue the voice and say, fail. And the fellow begins to fail. It's a terrible thing indeed. That is the voice you want to sound us now. Are you ready? Say, voice of witchcraft and familiar spirit assigned to wreck my life. Enough is enough. Be silenced by fire. Silence it. Silence your voice. Silence it by fire. My soul to Be silenced. Be silenced. Be silenced. Be silenced by fire. Be silenced by fire. Be silenced by fire. Every voice. Uh -huh. Making people to fall into error. Right there where you are. Uh -huh. Silence them. Silence them. My soul to Caporia. In the name of Jesus. Let them be silent. Let them be silent. In Jesus. Now we pray. You know, all these voices I'm talking about, they are a voice of witchcraft and familiar spirit. The agenda is a wicked agenda. It is the same kind of voice that makes people to fall into unpardonable error. The fellow is a good person doing things well. All of a sudden, it falls into error. It's an evil voice. Are you ready? Say, voice of witchcraft and familiar spirit. Assigned against my life. Enough is enough. Be silenced by fire. In the name, silence them. Silence your voice. Masita Caporia. Riposotolia le Katanda Yaba. Mapota Katenda Yaba. In the name of Jesus. Silence them. Silence them. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. In Jesus. Now we pray. Thank you, Father. Everlasting King of Glory, I thank you. I bless your name because all power both in heaven and on earth belong to you. I commit every soul connected to this program into your hand. And I pray that beginning from today God will give you a voice that will swallow the voice of your enemy. In the name of Jesus. Uh -huh. God will give you a matter of wisdom that no witches or wizard can contend with. In the name of Jesus. And every straight voice evil voice assigned against your life. The voice of witchcraft, familiar spirit, voice from the waters, voice from the marine kingdom, those voices that are bombarding your life, right there where you are, 
I silence them. In the name of Jesus, I silence them. In the name of Jesus, I lose you from the grip of any satanic voice. In the name of Jesus, beginning from today, right there where you are, receive dominion power to overcome every strange voice. In the name of Jesus, it shall be well with you. Thank you, Holy Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I encourage you to continue with us. We shall continue this prayer next uh, Friday by the grace of God. We shall continue. Let's share the grace in fellowship. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the same fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow us days of our lives, and we shall dwell in us and praise of God forever and ever. Amen. Say one powerful hallelujah. 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 Jesus, cover us with your blood and love as we go in your name, in your name. Mighty God, cover us with your fire and power. Jesus, cover us with your blood and love as we go. In your name, amen.